Hi, and welcome back. So we are gonna get to do the fun part, which is the cash stuffing, or mostly fun part, because yes, there are taxes and stuff involved. So I finally finished editing that uh, first video because I knew I wasn't gonna be able to do it if, um, if I tried to film this one right behind it because my phone's full. Like, I can't believe I already need like more storage, like on another iPhone, and I just, I refuse because this one still works. So I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna deal with it and figure it out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put the iPad over there and grab all my stuff. So I did make this, but unfortunately I cannot sell it on my Etsy because this is a trademarked and copyrighted um, franchise. So, but I do love Studio Ghibli films and um, I just decided that I wanted to put all my prop money in here because I'm weird like that. <laughs> so um, I'm supposed to have 461, so I'm gonna count it real quick. So I'm gonna try and move some stuff around so I can get things in frame. So hope you guys are having a great day. Um, I have some stuff I need to do around the house, but I have been slacking a little bit because I found a new obsession, which are the um, like buildable dollhouses. I've been obsessed with dollhouses since I was little, but I never got to have one. So I found this for $7.99. Um, at Hobby Lobby the other day and I made it and it looks just like that. I don't want to move it because then everything's gonna fall But it took me like five hours to build it and then my husband got me another one which I'm almost done with um, And I love it. It's it's so much fun. Like it just It takes your mind away and you're just focusing on what you have to build and all that stuff So it helps and I think my ones are out of frame. So let me move this real quick But yeah, sorry. Uh, like I said, I hope you guys are having a great day <laughs> So I'm gonna go ahead and jump into it. So like last time, I just grabbed all of my envelopes that I'm gonna be stuffing, um, except for the challenges. And um, I'm gonna do it that way instead of having to flip back and forth. So first we have taxes, which is gonna be $92. So 50, 70, 90, 100, 150, 192 and again like last time also i'm not counting this because um i don't get to keep it so why um make myself sad that i don't um that i don't get to keep it <laughs> so I'm just gonna put that in there not counting it i did count apparently at some point but I don't wanna know because hopefully what I'm actually hoping for is that um, because it's my first year on Etsy and um, the IRS or whoever, everybody knows that businesses don't really make a lot of money their first year, you get tax deductions. So hopefully I won't have to give them everything. So that'd be nice if I get to do like a new video stuffing, um, basically my own tax return. Uh, Canva, I really should just leave the 14 in here, but I'm just gonna take it out because this is from last month and it was already automatically drafted from my bank account. So 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I need to make labels for these, but I'm, I've just gotten lazy lately. Like I'd rather do orders than make labels for these. So that is done. Tithes is getting the same as, um, Taxes, so 91, 92, 40, 90. And I'm not gonna count this one either because like I said, it's not mine. So I'm just gonna put that in there and move on. Okay, gas, I'm not, I don't have a gas envelope because I just use my debit card at the pump. So I'm gonna take this 20 and I'm gonna put it aside because I don't, that way I don't forget and have like an extra 20 floating around. And, oh, I think this is what that was for. But I always use like the, the full amount. So I'm not gonna, yeah, I'm not gonna bother with that. I always use a full amount because I never like go just under the amount. I always put in exactly what I know I have. So, Bubbers has uh, another 20, so now he has 40. And I will fill out that tracker later because I don't wanna bore you guys with filling those out on camera. Why is this here? This shouldn't be here. 
No fun money today. Clothes has 10. No, sorry, clothes has 20. It's getting a 10. So now I'm up to $30 in clothes and looks like I didn't fill them out last time. That's bad because I need to remember when I used what. So I really need to start filling those out. All right, self-care is getting $10 because although I am good on pretty much all of my stuff, um, just in case something comes up, I have some cash to get toothpaste, shampoo, whatever. But like I said, I'm re actually really good on all that right now. So self-care is done. Home maintenance is getting $10. Home maintenance doesn't have anything. Um, this is mostly for like, uh, we have a pure filter. I think it's pure on the uh, faucet, but um, we need to get another one. So I need to, I think they're like a two pack for like 20 something, almost $30, somewhere around there. So uh, we actually really need to get that soon. So that is done. And then the next is Yes Fit, which I didn't write on this tracker. That's what this is. So actually, let me write that real quick. Okay, and that is getting $10 for the next race that I wanna do. And I've been slacking because, like I said in the last video, you can go at your own pace. But, I mean, it's better for you and you see more results when you're trying to, you know, lose weight for health reasons. When you do it every day or at least every other day. And I think it's been like three days since I got on the treadmill. So, <laughs> but this helps because at least I will be motivated to get on the treadmill. I forgot to say that last time. Because if I'm spending money, then I'm going to want my stinking reward that I paid for. So, I'm, and I don't want to like lie and say, oh yeah, I did like three miles every day until I get my reward for not doing it. Like, I don't feel right about that. So this is a motivation to get on the treadmill. I just need to get more motivated. But enough about that. Celebrations is getting 20 and that is for our anniversary. These are separated. So it's not like, so like 50s for Christmas, 25s for my mom. And then there's another 20 but I need to write anniversary so I know that, wait, I did that wrong. 95, yeah, I can't count. Um, so I know that not all of this is for like one thing, like my mom's birthday, Christmas and anniversary are all in here. I just put on these nails today, guys, and although I love them because I like the color, um, they're kind of hard to uh, to let me use the envelopes. So let's see, Overages isn't getting anything, which sucks. Business is getting a 20. I did have to use some of it the other day to go to Hobby Lobby to pick up some more supplies. So I think I'm actually down to 15. It might actually be less than that, but we're just gonna go with it for now. So now it has five, 10, 15, 35. I'm really bad with the trackers. I don't know why I have them in there if I'm not gonna use them. So thrifting is next, which is one of the new ones. And that is getting a five which I will have to go to the bank and withdraw some of this money, but most of it stays in the bank. But this one will, I will have to like swap out with real cash at some point. But since I'm not going thrifting anytime soon, I'm not really worried about that. This is the Mrs. one I was talking about to replace my engagement ring that I lost the diamond on on my birthday, like I said, and to change my name, which that's gonna cost a lot of money, so. Better start, I mean, better late than never. I should have started saving for that like years ago, as soon as I lost it, but oh well. Apps is getting, wait, yeah, sorry. I'm like, I can't, my eyes are weird. 
So apps is getting five, there's nothing in there. So I'm just gonna put it in here. And I think, yeah, I need to write on the back so at least I know what this money is for. Whoops. And then car maintenance is getting 10. As you guys know, this money is to upkeep the car that my parents are loaning me. So let's see, that's getting 10. And I wanna, I kinda wanted to swap this 100 out, but I mean, I still have plenty of them, so that's fine. So we have 120, 130, 140 in car maintenance. And I think I'll need an oil change in like another month because like I said, I don't drive far, so I don't need oil changes as often. And then car insurance is getting, did I put a 10 in there? Yeah, I did. And then car insurance is getting a 20. So now car insurance is up to 20, 40, 60, 80. I think it's due in, September or November, one of the two. I can't remember right now, it's on the app on my phone, but at least I have something to help my husband with. I know that 20 is staying in the bank, so I'm gonna take this and put it aside. And then emergency fund is getting a 10. An emergency fund does have money in here, or like prop money. Here we go. So it's getting a 10, so now we're up to, so we have 500, which these you can purchase from my shop. 600, 700, 800, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 900. So I actually need to swap this out for another placeholder. So I'm gonna go ahead and swap it out for this one that you can also purchase in my shop if you're based in Florida and um, you like you want something a little bit different. 50, 60, 70, 80, whoops. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, yep. So we're gonna move this over here and do this. So one, two, three, four, and five is 900. So that's awesome. I just need another 100 for emergency fund. And even when it hits 100, like then I wanna start the uh, three months or the one month ahead. And then once the one month ahead is funded, then I wanna to go to three months ahead and then six months, just because you never know. So that is it for this video. I'm gonna do a really quick one for the savings challenges. And I thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.